Don Geisler had one field left to harvest Monday. It was the one he keeps around to harvest for fun. Geisler broke out farm equipment from the 1950s, including a sheller and two combines, and had fun with several other area farmers. I've done all this already a long time ago. Glad for the advancement of the modern equipment is way better setting out in the dust like we used to. And retirement, he's glad for that too. <laughs> That's pretty important. One of the things is now that you can come out and watch it and don't have to. Yeah. If I have to do it, then that's another story. About 20 people of all ages were out to watch or help with the harvest. Onlookers were able to get on a trailer pulled by a tractor and follow the progress of the combines through the field so they could see how it works. A lot of people just like to see it done because, you know, they haven't. Uh, if they're about 35 or so years old, they're too young to have ever seen this in operation on their dad's farm. Like, when I was uh, just old enough, probably six or seven years old, this is the kind of equipment my dad used. So it's just kind of something to kind of relive the past. See, we're doing the complete shelling, and most of the time in the day when they pick the corn in the ear corn, they would pick it and put it in cribs and then shell it in the winter time. So you could have a three or four man crew probably here uh, just picking the corn in the ear and putting it into the, uh, uh, to a crib if we had one, but we're just using a wagon to, instead of the crib to, so we could ever see everybody have the sheller run. We just kind of enjoy doing it and uh, we just, uh, Hopefully we'll continue to do it. This is our third year and it's growing a little bit every year. And so we're gonna plan on continue doing it just as long as we can.